An area high school is shutting down for the rest of the week as its students are shutting down. Continuing coverage of breaking news tops Fox 11 News at 9 for this Wednesday night. Good evening, everyone. Ashwaubenon High School administrators say 41% of their students called in sick today. And staff members say plenty of the students who did come to school probably should have stayed home. A lot of those students are dealing with flu-like symptoms, though there's no confirmation that it's H1N1. Fox 11's Lindsay Veramus joins us now live from the high school with the latest. Lindsay? District leaders say this was not an easy decision, but after talking with the Brown County and state health departments, they feel this is in the students' best interest. They want a healthy school come Monday. With the usually packed hallways, now a Spartan scene. Ashwabanon High School has hit a breaking point. My classrooms, empty. I have had my math room. We can't go on because there's not enough students in our classroom to be taught things. On Monday, 29% of students were out sick. On Tuesday, 32. It's only the high school. Now a 41% absence rate will keep the school closed to students for the rest of the week. When you have that amount and then you have another additional part of your student body who is walking around coughing, uh, hacking, etc., uh, then you know it's, it's the right thing to do. Principal so, Mark Sheedy says right staff now. members will report as usual on Thursday and Friday, but the school is hoping to break the cycle of student illness. They want to come to school and they try to make it here and it's tough to tell a kid no if you're sick stay home. Sheedy says a few teachers are ill but they've fared much better than the students. I had a temperature of 103 degrees and I was sick Sunday and Monday. Anthony Barrientos made it back to the classroom only to leave it again. Like most students he has mixed feelings. While the closure means a day off for some students, it's season ending for others. Athletic events are canceled through Saturday. That's a, that's a bitter pill to swallow. And yet when they understood the big picture, they knew. Sheedy says student health comes first. The district's other schools will remain open. Leaders say their absence rates are normal for this time of year. The school's principal says last weekend's homecoming dance may have helped spread the illness. Sheedy says he talked with other districts and Ashwabanon is the only one with this many students sick. Yesterday, another area school, NEW Lutheran in Green Bay, closed for the day. Reporting live in Ashwabanon, Lindsay Veramis, Fox 11 News.